I grew up in Capitol Texas. Played uh, basketball in high school and did track. Basketball, I was a small forward, and track, I did sprints. Joined the military because I was a knucklehead. October through December, I was in boot camp and then went straight on to A school and then to my first command in Wanimi. Here I deployed twice to Afghanistan, one to, once to Africa. Love my job, wouldn't trade it for the world. March 2015, I was on my way back to work from lunch. I was on my CBR 1000 and a car cut in my lane hit me head on. When an accident happened, I figured I just broke my leg. I'd go on a cast for a couple months and go back to work, but I guess it wasn't that easy. My leg was pretty much cut off and life has just changed drastically. So when I first got to Walter Reed, it was March 22nd, they told me that they were gonna have to amputate. So that night I cried and did everything that a normal person would do. When it came around to November, the decision was 10 times easier to make because I'd already made it and accepted it. So when I was down at my lowest of lows, I saw a 17-year-old kid who's had cancer for 10 years. And he lost his whole leg. He was a hip dysartic. And this boy had the biggest smile on his face. So I figured if he can deal with cancer for 10 years and be happy, I've been dealing with this for six months. Why am I here sad and crying? There's always somebody worse off than you. And just because I'm sitting here depressed down doesn't mean my life's gonna stop. For me, the Warrior Games is another way to be competitive again, to get your foot in the door of competing at an adaptive level. So if I can get my foot in the door here and get a foundation of what the sports are and how it's gonna work, I think I can build on to make anything better. It feels awesome to be able to play basketball with a team again, but the hardest part is learning to figure out all the new rules and how to work a wheelchair the way they want you to, but it, the feeling is unimaginable. I think it makes me a stronger person. It makes me better because I just pretty much adapt and overcome because not everybody can adapt just moving forward because your life's not gonna stop just because you're injured or you're ill. You just have to keep moving forward.